All right, if you didn't see the announcement last night, we just got VRChat's open beta 2022 1 1 build 1166, which gives us OSC, and they have implemented it for avatars and working on implementing it for worlds. What is OSC? Open Sound Control is a generic system for passing information back and forth, originally made for audio equipment. VRChat is using it to allow individuals to make controls and programs for handling all sorts of random things, like eye and mouth tracking or responding to heartbeat stuff or whatnot. You get the idea. Since it's just avatars right now, there's no Udon hooks yet, though according to their GitHub milestones, it's coming soon, TM. They're also working on haptics output, so since OSC is both input and output, they plan to convert touch information in-game for haptics devices. Uh, no more relying on shader witchcraft. Uh, okay, there will still be users doing shader witchcraft. That's not going to change. There's a million things that this could be used for, but uh, one example is integration with avatar dynamics when that comes out, where a user presses buttons on a mixer board on their avatar that talks with their actual synths or whatever on their computer for VR DJ. You, you get the idea. There's a lot of random stuff that you can do with this. For other features, VRChat added tunneling, which is a uh, visual effect that cuts out everything but what you are going for. Uh, this is a option in the comfort and safety settings, and realistically, you'll know if this is for you. As for Udon, we got the player respawn event, so we can call VRC player API dot respawn on whatever player we are locally trying to respawn. You no longer need to rely on teleporting the player into the void below to trigger VRChat's respawning stuff. As for fixes, there's a big list, but really only one that I'll cover. Uh, synced objects should wiggle less weirdly when transferring ownership. Uh, emphasis on should. There, there's plenty of other fixes. Most of them are either not creator focused or I just don't plain understand them. So feel free to check them out for yourself at the link below. On another note, VRChat posted a video of Kung and a few others using 10 point tracking, the like knee and elbow tracking. And presumably the OSC blog post calls this the improved IK. So for people with expendable income, I'm sure a lot of hardware is getting purchased uh, this week. <laughs> <laughs> Well, uh, there you have it. Uh, not much for Udon this time, but since integration is coming soon, I felt like I needed to get this out. Uh, hope you enjoyed. I swear I still make content. It's just been slow and I've been uh, busy with work and stuff. I, I swear the post-processing slider tutorial thing is fully recorded. I, I just haven't edited or posted anything yet. It, it is taking a while, okay?